Uh, welcome to Lund University and the Department of Chemical Engineering and the uh, process development unit that we have listed as a tree search infrastructure. Uh, Christian will show you a little bit later what we can and uh, are doing in, in this equipment and uh, what, what this was or originally built for was to steam pretreat material for, uh, for the ethanol program as a pretreatment before enzymatic hydrolysis. Uh, since then we have developed uh, our methods uh, and we are regularly using it for pretreatment of wood or agricultural residues. For example, for uh, extraction of uh, hemicellulose, but we have also pretreated uh, 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 normal craft pulp in order to decrease the degree of polymerization. Uh, if you are interested in using this uh, infrastructure that we have, uh, you're perfectly welcome to uh, come in contact with us uh, and we can discuss with you what's possible and what's not in, ter in terms of operating conditions and uh, uh, what you can expect from the material. We have experience from pretreatment of 30 something different kinds of lignocellulosic biomass, for instance. So it can be used for other things than wood. Uh, wood is, of course, one part of the tree search uh, uh, infrastructure that we are offering, but we, we also do other biomasses. Okay, uh, now we have weighed in our spruce wood for steam explosion. We take the wood up to the reactor. A 10 liter reactor. The top valve is opened and we fill in the material. After the material is, is filled in, we close the hatch. Hello, close the valve. Put it on automatic. Check that the valves are closed. Start the process. The steam is now uh, uh, in the reactor. It's heated up to uh, 200 degrees. So when the time has elapsed, the bottom valve will open. Right there. And that's the procedure until uh, introducing new material into the reactor or closing for the steam and taking out the steam pretreated material.